boys and girls. Today, I have a read aloud for you that is in a link below. I cannot find this book, but it is so fun. You know, most of the stories that we write are told from our point of view. Yesterday, you wrote about the first day of kindergarten. One of you might have said that the first day of kindergarten was fun. Somebody else might have written and said the first day of kindergarten was scary. We have our own point of view. That means that the way that I see the same thing might be different from how you see it. I often think about how a lot of fairy tales have wolves as the bad guy. You know, there's Little Red Riding Hood where the wolf goes and tricks her. You got the three little pigs, and in that story, the wolf blows down their houses. And there are all these stories where wolves are the enemy. But the thing about wolves is they're actually very shy creatures. And they really wouldn't attack a human unless they were starving and had no other idea what to eat. The fact that um, all these stories have wolves going after the characters it's kind of an unlikely thing. So why is it that the people who wrote those stories make the wolves into the villain, the bad guy? Well, probably because farmers um, might lose some sheep or some young cows to a wolf here and there. And so they may not have liked them very much, but I don't know. It's just that wolves are often made into the bad guy. But a wolf has to eat, right? When it goes and, and gets a sheep, it's not really trying to be a bad guy. It's trying to eat and feed its young. And so I think about Jack and the Beanstalk a lot. Is it right for Jack to go and steal from the giant? What do you think? So in this story, you're going to hear the story from the giant's point of view. Point of view is how the giant feels. So when you listen to this story, it is going to be told by the giant and the giant is going to be explaining how this whole Jack and the Beanstalk situation makes the giant feel. So listen carefully. In the end, who do you agree with? Jack and his side or the giant and his? What do you think? I hope you enjoy this story. I think it's kind of funny. <laughs> 